Hi, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to take the classic game of Guess Who and tweak it in a way to help your English language learners to feel more confident to be able to ask questions and answer questions using pertinent vocabulary. Your students are going to feel so successful and we're going to want to participate more in class because this game and so many other games are a gateway to help them feel more confident when using English language. Guess Who is a fun and interactive game played by children and adults. I think what makes this game so much fun is that you're trying to figure out your opponent's mystery person by asking descriptive questions that will elicit either a yes or no answer so that you can eventually get to who your opponent's mystery person is. But if you were like me, when I first introduced this game to my students, I didn't provide guidance and well, it went a little bit like this. You know, Sandra, I'm really enjoying playing Guess Who with you. Yeah, it is a lot of fun, as long as you don't make any of your corny jokes. Is your person one who has stinky feet? What do you mean, stinky feet? I can't tell by looking at them who would have stinky feet. Come on, let's just stick to the game. Come on, just answer the question. Yes or no, does your person have stinky feet? <sighs> Why must you always be making corny jokes? Don't hate the player, hate the game. So I wanna share with you this nifty guide that allows your students to know exactly what to say and they can choose any question in any order that they would like. It gives them the ability to use actual descriptive vocabulary within context and also it gives them the confidence to have conversation with another student in English. Please type in the comment section below if you think your students would benefit from this guide. I have included a link in the description below for you to use with your students. Thank you so much for watching and please be sure to leave a comment in the comment section below how this game went with your students as I would really like to know if your students really took a liking to this game. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week for more tips, strategies and resources for the English language learners in your classroom.